The salmon would grow twice as fast as normal, but taste the same and cost much less. The question is, should we eat it? It is very scary because, I mean, what are they putting in this stuff and what is going to be the side effects? The industry invented this salmon by taking a single gene from an eel-like fish called the ocean pout, which grows year-round, and spliced it into a farm-raised salmon to keep the salmon's growth hormones on overdrive. When you have a genetically engineered animal... Expert after expert told the FDA panel that that genetic change did not change the salmon itself, that the flesh and nutritional content is no different from normal salmon, just as the company growing the fish has claimed. It means that it's the same as the traditional food. Uh, it's indistinguishable from the traditional Atlantic salmon. Keep genetically engineered salmon out of the food supply. But several environmental groups say the FDA has failed to study this fish outside the lab or in any kind of clinical trial. And the FDA hasn't done the necessary safety tests to make sure these, safe, these fish are safe for human consumption. Another concern is that these oversized fish could escape from the tanks where they are supposed to be confined and become predators. There's absolutely no way you can contain these salmon, and if they get out, it's a threat to wild uh, salmon. Several of the outside experts also questioned the FDA's conclusions, and now the FDA has 60 days to rule if this fish should be sold as food and if it should be labeled. Even with approval, however, it could still be years before the first gene-altered salmon is on the table. Wyatt Andrews, CBS News, Washington.